Hey guys, happy Monday. Can you guess where I'm at? Can you guess, can you guess? If you said Ross, you are absolutely correct. So we are at Ross for Monday Markdowns. And you remember this purse? I actually purchased this purse from Target for the 90% off sale. So I have it as my little backpack and I like it for hands free. Okay, this definitely works. Now, we're going to go ahead and go to the beauty section. And guess what, guys? I already hear them marking down. So let's go ahead and take a look and see what they have. All right, guys. So the first thing that I see is the beauty section. And the lady did explain to me that they already have finished this section. So it looks like they have a lot of the gift sets that are still left over from Christmas. Like this hand cream set. It is $4.99. Not bad because you get six of them. And then... It looks like they have some items that are still left over for Valentine's Day because love is sweet. Yes, it is. And they have like a lot of the scented soaps. Some of them are marked down. Some of them are not. Now they have the Sandalwood Body Collection set. And this one isn't marked down. So I think it's just kind of hit or miss. Um, I did see this, which is your Deluxe Pamper set. Pretty cool where you get nail polish, lotion, and some bath confetti, okay. And a plush robe to go with it. And this is $9.99, okay. So um, she did explain to me that all the items that they marked down is clearly right here. So when we go through and we're looking, I see that they have some Lorac, which is $4.99. Now guys, I know you hate to see the items through <laughs> the glass butt or the containers, $2.99. So it looks like everything ranges from Estee Lauder to Kat Von D and $3.99, $3.49. These still are not bad prices at all. Now this is an Estee Lauder travel kit and this is $20.99. That may have been the most expensive item that I've seen. Um, but then even when you go through, you can see like this is an oil set. And this is $5.49. They have vanilla almond lotion, $2.99. Oh my gosh. This looks very promising. It's $2.99 moisturizing face wash. Now this looks like it was probably part of a set. Um, but hey... You know, sometimes you have to pull things apart. Ooh, this looks nice. A priming set and an all-in-one beauty evolved, which is this. Have you guys heard of this brand? I should have known it was not on clearance at $7.99. But, oh my gosh, that sounds like it would work amazing. Now, this is a great deal. It's $3.99 and it's a Vino two-piece set. To me, you can still get the sets cheaper for after Christmas. Like, you can get a whole Vino set for $4.50. It's not a bad deal. This is a great deal for the Colossal Mascara because this is only $1.99. And a lot of times these are like $6.99, $7.99. So $1.99 for it, you cannot beat that. Now, I know a lot of my followers are not really just makeup wearers or users at all. But I am going to show that. For some people who do love makeup, they do have like the makeup brushes for only $6.99. And then they have different makeup palettes like this Revolution um, palette. And this one is only $3.99. Now, I have never used the Revolution palettes at all. So let me know if you tried that brand. Is it cheap or how does it work? Like, definitely let me know. And they have $4.99. So, guys, look, all of this is clearance. Like, you can't beat that. And then this is some Dove lotion. This is $3.49 and they have quite a few of these. And I think they have different flavors. This one looks like it smells great. Oranges, hmm, okay. And so they have like coconut, they have coconut, orange, and I think it was one more on here. They also have some Shea Moisture all-in-one or four-in-one all-over wash. This is $4.99. And then I thought this was really cute, which is a bath bomb set. Now, I don't know if I wanna create my own little bath bomb, but they do have this and it's only $2.99. So they do have a lot of different options. This is looking very promising, especially for a Monday. So if you haven't hit it to Ross, 
you definitely want to probably check out Ross on this Monday. And let me know, like, should I put Ross in the rotation? Like, do y'all want to see Ross markdowns maybe two Mondays out the month or maybe every Monday? Let me know down below. Let's go ahead and go to the next section. All right, guys. So I went and pre-searched like some of the purses to see what was on clearance. And the purse section isn't that much, but they did have a few Steve Madden items. Like this is a cute little fanny pack. It is $13.99. Um, and I thought this was really cute. And I love just like the camel color. And it looks like most of the Steve Madden bags. Now this was originally $98 and they have it on sale for $27.99. It's like a dark charcoal color with the studs. So if that's what you're into, now they did have some great purses. Uh, this one is a Michael Kors fanny pack as well. And this one is $16.99. So not bad at all. Great selection. You know, Ross prices are already inexpensive, so we don't even have to go there. This would be nice for like traveling. It's very like low key, small pocket running through the airport and it's a crossbody. And this one is $6.99, so not bad no name works out well and then we've seen some of these purses already and this is $22.99 this is an auto purse so for $22.99 not bad and then this one behind it is a two-in-one and it kind of gives me like the Brahmin feel now this material is very cheap and flimsy and this is $20.99 and it says that it's a two-in-one but I don't see the wallet on the inside and then you have this purse, which is a Roberta, a Roberta Prani. Never heard of this brand at all. And this is on clearance for $59.99. I'm not sure if this one is a good deal. The quality doesn't feel that great to me at all. But on here, if you just go through, I still love looking at their purses. And for some reason, I was like a big auto fan, which we don't have that store in Huntsville. Um, but I used to go to Nashville and shop at auto. And I love the fact that all their purses and stuff you can find in Ross now. So those are the few purses. Let's go ahead and go to the other or another section. Is there any good deals? <laughs> no. There's some. <laughs> so it looks like our shoe selection is really stacked over here. So I will say this, it looks like they did get several trucks because look at all of these shoes to choose from. Now I'm not gonna go through and see really what is marked down for the shoes because it is a lot of shoes but how cute are these for the kids oh my gosh and puma slides and little felines oh my gosh look at this and they even have some sandals out guys i may just have to do another video and just show like the new things that they have because look at all of this now i'm just hitting up all the little clearance areas and when it comes to the girls um, one thing I noticed that it looks like there is a lot of Under Armour on sale. So it looks like the workout. Now this is only $4.99 and it's a soccer Under Armour top as well as they have this top that says wake up and play. This is $6.99 and this is really cute for $6.99. It is a two-piece set. Now I don't know. I think you can still wear this in spring. I think that will still be doable. Um, and you just go through, it looks like, once again, it's just like a lot of workout items. I thought these were adorable. These are Under Armour as well, and they are only $9.99. So if you do have a child that's very athletic, you may want to look into it. And these are nice as well. And these are $9.99. So <clears throat> the clearance isn't just like the lowest 49 cents that we're used to seeing at all um, but you can find some different items this is for 99 so we'll go check out the males and see what we can find over there as well so when it comes to boys and babies it is pretty much non-existent <laughs> you can barely find anything and then the items that i that i am finding they're like still 10.99 like this shirt they want 10.99 for it oh my gosh no so i would not suggest that um well our store i'll say that does not have much for boys and then when we go over here to babies the only few things that i've seen 
was this is a cute little set it's 4.99 it comes with the hat as well to match and that was it so you see the clearance goes literally from here to here and there's nothing on it so and it looks like yeah there's nothing to even show so let's go ahead and go over to another section and see what we can find so our furniture section is not the best but they do have a few pieces that stand out to me so one of the pieces that stand out are these two navy blue chairs or accent chairs absolutely love this my couch in my living room is this color so this isn't bad for um 99.99 now I also love this green bench and I don't think you could see it but it has like the gold trimming down at the bottom and it's like a storage bench. I thought that was nice. Now I think at another store that we visited we seen already like the storage containers and these are $39.99. I think I showed them at Home Goods. So not necessarily the best and then they have like little knickknacks. This is $27.99 they have a small little desk not bad at all and it has where you can plug in like your little outlets here your usb and this desk is 79.99 and then they have like a little bit more like plug in outlets not bad at all i mean our furniture this i thought was really really nice as well which is like a gray furniture bench and this is 179.99 so you can see they have a little bit but not probably as much as you're used to seeing let me know what do you think about the furniture now this bar is pretty cool as well let's see how much is this 79.99 and it's the outdoor so that would work great for spring and summer but let's go ahead and go to the next section it's just not that many clothes on clearance in my store so this is one of the clearance racks and you can see just how scarce it is this is $8.99 and it's a puma shirt um, this is $23.99 and it's a Ralph Lauren shirt or sweater and I'm just going through and it's nothing really spectacular to speak on I mean look at all this empty space and so yeah I'm not going to really go through clothes, but I think today the winner for me had to be um, beauty and I would say probably even children um, and they're still working on the adult women's shoes. So I didn't go back and I'm sure they're going to continue to mark throughout the store, but um, I just did not want to stay. I'm here a little bit early. <laughs> so, I mean, and it wasn't just much that I seen that I wanted anyway. So I am going to go on to my next store, but let me know um, what you guys think. Should we go ahead and add Ross to the rotation or nah? Like, let me know in the comments below. And have you been to Ross since that past um, 49 cent sale, like since last month in January? Let me know as well. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. All right, bye.